We knew last year that we had a pretty good squad, but this year we're all older, we're all more mature, we're all better, stronger. It's been great for us. After losing just two seniors and exiting the playoffs early, Skowhegan baseball is leaving last year in the past and our top contenders in A North. From last year, we knew that we still had a young team and that only losing two seniors wasn't going to hurt us a lot. The season was going to be big, a lot of confidence going in. That confidence has only been heightened with their pitching. The Riverhawks have a near full rotation of four guys who can start on the mound. It's awesome. Like, it's nice to have all those guys be able to come out and just chuck for us. It gives us the ability to have at least one ready to relieve any game, any situation, at any time. You know, it, it just gives us the ability to pitch week to week. With that, the Riverhawks are allowing just two runs a game. However, they're putting up just four, something they're really honing in on as the postseason nears. Just try to make contact with the ball, put it in play. A lot of the guys, they just try to hit home runs. It doesn't come like that. It just comes when we least expect it. So we just need to go up there and just try to get a base hit. And despite the team hitting somewhat of a plateau, losing three of their last four, there are no nerves around here. We hit a cold spot, so what uh, happens to everyone? We'll be just fine, you know. There's nobody who can beat us. You know, when we're on it, we're on it. And with that mentality, they hope to be on their way to the first state title in program history. It'd be awesome. It'd mean the world. It'd be one of the best memories of high school career. I've wanted to win a baseball state championship with this team. I love this team. Everybody on it. They're just a bunch of good guys. I think we deserve it. In Skowhegan, I'm Ryan Sudall, ABC 7, Fox 22 Sports.